Hey guys, it's Matt, and I'm back with my completed e-bike build. So this is my 1990-something specialized hard rock sport, which I upgraded to an e-bike using uh, EM3 EV upgraded Mac motor, which you can see down here along with a 12 FET Infineon controller and a 15 amp hour lithium ion battery from BMS battery so let me just give a quick walk through around the bike so here you can see the tail light that I put in it's a 10 LED tail light and you can see the battery and the rack that holds the battery pack Here up front you could see my 10 watt Cree LED headlight which I just bought you know a regular 10 watt Cree LED light on Amazon it was like 20 bucks and just mounted it onto my original reflector mount. Here you could see some of the wires bundled up then up on the handlebars we have emergency cutoff brake levers this is the uh, main ignition control this is the cruise control this controls my lights this is not, un is not used right now then up top you can see I have a cycle analyst and then on the other side we have throttle control 50 percent 75 and 100 percent and then the throttle which is a thumb throttle which I can't push down because it's on right now also in the front wheel since I went with a geared motor right here I have mounted my speed sensor and there's a corresponding magnet mounted on the spoke so that helps uh, those two combined together will give me my speed reading and you'll see right here in the middle of the wheel and out near the edge I have my monkey light uh, 10 LED uh, lights for show just for making my bike more visible at night and here you could see the wire I got this uh, special braided loom online which is expandable and it worked out really well for carrying the wire bundle from the front to the back here you can see my Anderson power pole 50 amp which connects to the battery and here is battery you can lock it in and control to use a key to control when power is going to it and then underneath the rack I mounted my Infineon 12 FET controller so it stays kind of neatly out of the way and then the upgraded Mac 8T motor geared brushless hub motor and I again I use that braided loom to cover up the wiring and I went with the gray which nicely matches with the with the color of the bike frame and I also use some gray zip ties to help also better conceal the wiring so this is just a quick tour of the exterior of the bike I'll do another video demo demonstrating the bike in action and give some more specs on how the bike is performing thanks for watching